Hey, my name is Brad Riley with AeroCharger Turbos. Uh, what we've done the last couple of days is taken a completely stock sled, uh, weighed it, and then we've gone through several different versions. Uh, weight's a huge deal, power to weight ratio um, is, is king on the hill, maneuverability, things of that nature. So first thing we did is we weighed the sled. We ended up at 519.8. And keep in mind, that is a wet sled with a few gallons of fuel ready to ride. Uh, the next thing we did was we put a stock turbo kit on it. Um, this turbo kit is lighter this year than it was in previous years. Um, we've kind of done a mid-season release on some lighter weight components. That put us at 521. So that's not a bad gain considering uh, the horsepower goes to 240 to 250. Um, the XPs, we actually lost weight, but that's because the muffler and the airbox uh, were heavier in the XPs than they are in the XMs. We, uh, we, we developed what we call the race muffler. Um, it's, a, it's kind of an exotic aluminum tube. We ceramic coat the inside to protect it. And we installed the race muffler and that took us down to 516.2. So it's a very considerable drop. Uh, that is something that's available uh, now to the consumer. Quantities are a little bit limited. It's very difficult to make. Um, plating the inside of a tube with ceramic is difficult. The next thing we did was we installed the air to snow intercooler. Um, coolest intercooler on the market. Uh, this is for the guy that wants to hit a hill over and over and over and over. It'll keep the engine cool, keep everything consistent. With the air to snow and the race muffler, our weight was at 518. So still, actually, we're less than stock. Um, race muffler obviously has a lot to do with that. We have a whole list of things we'll be doing to this because this, this is in our fleet. Um, but we, we put a, a, a race hood on it and um, uh, Calvin loves his, his snow plow to keep the snow out of his face. It's a great accessory for BRP. But that put us at 5097. So that's air to snow intercooler, race muffler, race hood, you know, capable of 275, 300 horsepower, all the gearing, all the vents. We're 10 pounds lighter than stock. Weight's a big deal on these sleds. We go to a lot of effort, whether it's trying to look at lighter skis, lighter shocks, lighter A-arms, carbon fiber, you know, fancy tunnels and, and, and footboards and handlebars. And, um, you know, the general rule used to be 100 pounds, or I'm sorry, $100 a pound. Well, you know, that goes back 20 years. That would be very cheap weight to get rid of now. We're the lightest kit there is. We'll give you the total weight of our kit. Be sure to shop around and make sure you're not, you know, adding 15 pounds or 10 pounds because that's a lot of money that you're going to have to spend elsewhere just to get down into the ballpark of where we are now uh, with the AeroCharger kit. We've got more things we'll do to this. We'll update you uh, in our blog. Be sure to follow that. It's really interesting this time of year as we're building the race sleds and doing some pretty radical stuff. Thanks for your time. Thanks for watching.